There are new developments today in what's been shaping up to be a battle over the historic Emancipation Oak at Hampton University and the HRBT expansion project. Uh, shortly after the university announced a news conference on the issue, Virginia Secretary of Transportation announced the state's plan. Tonight on your side, Stephanie Harris was at the Regional Transportation Board meeting and joins us in the newsroom with the latest. Steph? Anita Tom, Transportation Secretary Aubrey Lane said the state will not take any property from Hampton University to widen I-64. He stood before the Hampton Roads Transportation Planning Organization and said that emphatically we are not going to take any property, particularly any historical property. We understand the history of the Emancipation Oak um, and uh, while on the west side there doesn't appear to be a historical land there, uh, if they think it is, we'll try to avoid it at all costs possible. Lane went on to say that it is going to be more expensive to do the project now, but he could not tell us just how much it will cost. Lane's announcement came after Hampton University announced a news conference for tomorrow addressing this issue. A university spokesperson told me this afternoon that news conference will go on as planned despite the secretary's promise. An attorney for Hampton University cited a history of abuse by the highway department, including taking more property than needed. Of course, we will be at Hampton University's news conference tomorrow. It starts at noon. Look for updates on air and on wavy.com. Stephanie Harris, 10 on your side.